Anyway, Trailblazer coming in. Good paranoia. Tries to cut them off over at long. Jubu will find a nice headshot onto 10x, but Solo will strike him down. Going over now. And elbow is Skuna. Five point comes in, suggests just going to be pulling back, keeping himself safe. Looks, oh my god, instantly takes out Hans. Nade going to be going over towards the spawn, tries to line it up, gets the shoulder tap, gets the headshot through the box onto Skuna. That is three for Suggest. He's looking to fast track this showstopper as best as possible. Will get taken out by Hyuni. Still going to be full HP. Got the dink on it. Doesn't manage to get any damage pushed in. We'll just back up. Flashpoint goes in. Allow does finally find him. Skuna's going to be, tra be trading that one back. One for one exchange thus far. As 10x tries to play around this corner. That is work cut out for him though. Spectre. Be right full on. Hyuni. Will find a little headshot to get that elimination. Last pack to stop anybody pushing forward, but Suggest just going to be holding here, trying to keep him contained in the U-Haul. Now teleport is going to be used. Everybody shifting over. Solo's still lurking, though. He's going to try to catch them off guard, but Yanni comes up with a second. Very nicely done, and now the rotations can come through. They know they're moved up. Holding his angle, doing a great job. Dubu's turn. Uh, to try to hold an angle. Oh, Ooh, he takes some damage and suggests just pops it in the face with yep. that vandal. Really good checking. Just got a little suspicious. Rocket comes out. That's going to be Bingsu saying good night. The two members rotating over. HP advantage now in the hands for new turn as they look to defend this spike. It's going to unfortunately just unable to offer up any healing here for himself. Guiding light. Drawn out. Throws it. Gets a blind. But parry sprays him down. Tailwind into the cloud burst. Yoni will find a third. Now he's got a 1v1 versus Suggest. Phantom beat Vandal. He's going to go up top and the oh! knives come out. Gets the kill. And that is going to be four. We see that shorty there from Dubu. He's already shot it. So they know that this is present on the point. Allow gets himself in just jumping over top of him. But Dubu does manage to come up with 10x trading it back. Very peeks out the window though. Gets rid of the opposition. Let me open up the site. Spike gets planted, 4v3 for this defense here for new turn. One an elbow, two playing out towards CT. Jump across, Hans just looking at his gut as best as possible. Suggest, you know, had to move out of that position, but he's not given the opportunity. Gunny finds two, just like that. Very winnable for the side of the FR. Yanni just comes up with two, uh, you know, another two oh. kills. Has three on the round. Solo, he doesn't realize that Pink is right behind him. <laughs> Big oh. it. Oh, Kyoni whiffs on the shot though. So that's not too bad now. Be grateful for that. Hun's trying to stave off the rest of the squad that's moving up the short. Allow gonna be taken out. 10x gone as well. Suggest trades one, but Scooter right now gets the ace. He's about to set opening pick. Uh, he's gonna ignore the boom bot and gets solo. Great patience. Yep. Yeah. Which I think is pretty smart if you can get one. But I mean, Gunny is nuts. The read right now from DFR is perfect. Everybody's already started rotating over. You can see the lurk coming in from Dubu. He's just going to be chilling out in the spawn waiting for Perry because he knows that he's going to be rotating in that direction. Oh. The jump shot from Skuna finishes off 10x and yeah, Perry. Within that regard for sure. And it would have just been the icing on the cake had he been able to trade it back. So it doesn't manage to make that happen. So it is the man advantage right now for new turn. But that hasn't mattered so much thus far. Yanni's got the blade storm again if this comes to up close and personal. Shock. Oh man. After shock not gonna find any value, doesn't get any damage pushed through. Allow trying to hold things down. Tailwind out there for just a second. Yanni moves in, tries to grab a gun. Now thinking about pushing the cloud burst. Pulls back before it expires. Dart gonna be getting a little spot. Hold this to half. Yanni, oh manages to get one. Cannot get the other two. Spike. Chaos. All right, now it's a little bit ring around the rosy. Oh, 10 Killjoy yeah. setup is here from Bingsu. They'll clear one. Nanoswarms come out, and that's going to be 10x getting dropped. In onto the side, Perry does manage to find Skuna. Be TPing now into the corner. Spike is still down in Hookah, I believe. So, yeah, they have to jump. There you go. Oh, boy. Got it. Perry's not ready for it. Yanni just constantly in prime position. Spike could be planted by Allow, and suddenly it's a 2v4. Not complying through, so he just drops, but Bingsu's on the flank, has the kill. They push the corner. Yannick gets another one as Allow will fall. The defuse will be. As Allow will pick up the spike and bring this over to the B site. Oh, okay. 
just finds Dubu. He was, he was kind of second guessing whether or not he's actually looking at somebody, or maybe they got was, a clear elbow. You know, second guessing whether or not they saw him. Either way, he does get punished. Solid opening. This new turn looked to bring us four to eight in this half. And look at Bing Chu waiting for the reinforcements here. This is DFR is so disciplined. I mean, yeah, yeah, that he knows like they're not gonna push into here. It's it's too scary for them. They need to win this round, so they're just gonna try to play the side, maybe try to play a little bit of post plant. Huns pulling back as he has the rocket, but he does manage to find a Lao. A little bit of a look of disbelief there as Bing Su goes pressing forward, finds Sol and 10x parry suggests they are all dead! The lockout will be used in celebration as the spike gets defused. Onto the side teleporter going to be used by Suggest and Parry to get themselves over here a little bit faster. Connects just tucked away. Huns. Nice. So very low HP, but still gets that headshot kill. Onto Suggest. Start to check for a little bit. He only just snaps onto allow space with that frenzy. Finds one, finds another as 10x will get dropped. He and Bingsu versus Solo and Parry, but Solo will take down the low HP Killjoy. Just needs to do a little bit more, and he somehow wins that? What's he doing? I don't know. He was trying to fake. I think he's trying to fake that. He was going up over the crate. Yeah, suspecting that Parry is going to be inside the tube, and Yanni clutches it! Damage, he comes in there, full health, and he just gets completely outsmarted. He gets outsmarted. There's no other way to put it. That's a good reach out for 10x there. Going to take Bingsu down, but... This is just, I mean, honey, honey is, I don't know what he had uh, for breakfast, but oh. give me some of that. Oh, kind of caught there. Perry will find two before Skuna trades him out. It's a good reply round here for Newton, which is exactly what they need. They can't really afford to drop any more rounds here. Spike will get planted. Suggest tries to wrap around to the front of U-Haul, but Hunt manages to find two kills, and suddenly it's just allowed. He's trying to pull that way the hell back because of the Seeker. Let's get tagged up by that. Just waits it out. And I'm kind of surprised that he's still got running out with the sheriff in his hands. I was going to say, you do have a specter. And he's just, you know, just running around. This is so tough for him. You can get to half. That's right when that cloud burst drops. I'm trying to push him off. Oh, no way. No way. No way. How? How? How did he? Best he could with it. Now, oh, a Marshall as well on the backside of this. I was like, yeah, nah. <laughs> no. Don't drop back. Lau holding close, goes for the peak, manages to find both of them. Tailwind's over to the side to keep himself protected. And nice little flash point out on to be long. That's him to kill on a Hyuni. And then here comes the push as Hyuni oh. dashes in. Rolling Thunder from Solo. Coming through the teleporter, but they actually don't get the pinch in on the Huns, and he does manage to make that a one for one. Now Solo's gonna be eliminated. He only comes in, oh wow, turn it away for just a moment. Does get eliminated. Can't quite string it together, but Skuna is there to pick up the pieces. Finishes off parry, and now it is just 10x on his lonesome. Moves up into U-Haul. As the slow creep comes in from Bingsu. Oh, 10x didn't notice him. Gets Ooh. the dink, but screw it up. Just never in a million Ooh. years. Oh, careful. That all oh, allow. Oh, but he gets taken down by Honey again. Yep. Trades it out. Solo cannot make it into the teleporter. Now an operator on the ground in there if they want to try to pick it up at the end of the round and you know maybe just play it on attack. Perry can't land the shots and this is looking like DFR will be able to lock in a 12th round and guarantee themselves at least overtime. But at this point with the way the things are going for new turn, I don't think they're going to make it that far. Tenex, however, is trying to fight back. Drone comes in, Hyuni. Thought maybe he would just go for the push. Just was there to back him up though, so they play it out a little bit more patiently. But Bingsu again. Just lurking in from behind. It seems like nobody is ready for this. Nobody is looking over towards spawn. They are instead just focusing forward. But Johnny is on the hunt for an ace. He will not find it. His mental game today, that cross to try to grab the operator in the teleporter just got completely shut down. I <laughs> Did you see? Did you, this is, I mean, he's having the round of a life. Solo's dead. Okay, Solo's dead. Oh my dead. god. It, it seems like it's over. This is not good. I mean, everybody was over on A. You only have 10x in the corner on elbow. He's got to play KG here. He cannot fall. Boombot instantly spots, instantly gets cleared, allowed, dead. Can't get anything done with the Blade Storm. Spikes now being planted. 3v5 for the retake. There's a lockdown. There is no Hunter's Fury. Lockdown now going to be coming in. 
They have to pull out of elbow, so 10X is going to have to reposition. Perry is going to have to wait. 10X is dead. Suggest is dead. It's just Perry with a sheriff and a dream, but this is just very quickly turning into an absolute nightmare. They go pushing out. Huns will get dumb, but Hyuni... All right, well, into the action we go. We can stop the podcast. Thank you guys for tuning in. Make sure you subscribe to our Patreon and all that good stuff. Yeah. Dubu up top managed to find 10X. It will be a one for one, but Dubu... Looking to take the advantage, has to go for the reload, falls a little bit low, and will be finished off by Suggest as he comes hopping around the corner. Wall's going to be raised, both of them, as we do see Solo placing that Sage wall. The blind shots through the smoke, trying to get a hit onto him, but will not manage to make that happen. Suggest will get topped back up, have a 3v3, as new turn desperately try to get this pistol round win. Yeah, they know where Solo is. They're pretty sure about Suggest's position. The Hawk is going to catch Solo peeking. Sees the cross. Suggest has to throw in point blank. Whoa. Isn't going to get it. Now, but Perry is trying to drag this one back. The reload from Skuna. But Perry, he tries to retreat. Gets finished off, and there's plenty of time here. Create any back. He's just going to go ahead and exit and allow. First one to get finished off here on the approach. Trailblazer tries to get that hit to get the stun. Doesn't manage to make it happen. Blind's going to be good. 10X has to dip into the corner. Ooh, another Man. Hawk flying through, but Skuna cannot manage to line it up this time. 10X gets that elimination as Solo finds two more. And it's just Hyuni. Does have a Sheriff, though, so... Feels pretty possible, especially given how he's been performing. I'm just never counting this guy out now. Yeah. I just... It feels like with a Sheriff in a 1v2, he can win this, like, pretty handily. And even though the Spectres are there for new turn... You know, this guy has been so, so incredible. Uh, his lineups are insane. You know, he's checking all of his corners. He's doing all the right things. Solo trying to get cheeky. Turns at the wrong moment, but is able to adjust and take him down. Yeah. But everybody from Vince is piled into the side. The Seekers will go out. He's gonna, getting blinded. He's managed to clear it, but 10X just presses forward straight into the smoke. Even with the paranoia, comes up with the kill. I mean, the back. Finds two, low HP, and oh no! Into the snake Steps bite. through the cloud, gets taken to one, and the snake bite will finish him off. A bit of an unfortunate moment there for him, as Allow will be rezzed back into the fray. Bing Su, Bing up top, playing along the rafters, but knows that he's inevitably going to have to go into oh, the poison so cloud. Smart. Look, at his, look at his angle he can find from back there. Allow can you notice? Hello? Bing Su's on for just a moment. And Hans does indeed have an Odin. Wow, we'll find him. Six HP remaining, though. Kingsu uh, finds the kill. 1v2, but just because of this Viper's Pit, seems like it's just not going to be able to happen, so he will just pull out. Wow. Tagged up. Hans just chilling in the back. And yeah, will get finished off. Allow finding two now, breaking open this approach at green. Push through, and hello, Solo, just getting in behind Bingsu. Did Bingsu not put up the Tetris wall in two? I suppose not. Oh, Johnny. Really nice headshot! Whoa! Gets another one, but allow. We'll cut him down. Three kills for both Jet. Try to push underneath tubes, it looks like. Or maybe, no, they're going in towards a boiler here. Oh, sees it. Spotted for a second, but doesn't manage to get that kill. Paranoid does come out, and they just boost straight into his face. <laughs> oh, man. I love the that. boldness of the play. Had he had any backup at all, which they did not scout, that could have been absolutely horrific for them, but they still are protected. Hyuni cannot exit his parry. Crept his way into a main. They... <laughs> I, I mean, okay, so... Whoa! Oh, okay. Okay, long-range Odin win for Huns there. The Odin is just such an incredible gun. Nerf this gun, please. Yeah. I'm with you on that. Alright. Uh, his turn for that operator. Huns again. Oh, he gets a headshot on Allow with the Marshal! On the solo. Yeah, he wants to play this out. Peeks the corner. The tap-in gets his head. Massive pickoff now. Two members down. Huns trying to line it up. Barely makes it back behind Yellow, but he did get the hit on the 10X. Heels have to be burned. Just tries to keep them all topped up. Here comes the pit. And yeah, Hun Huns just needs to get the hell in there. Keep this thing sustained and try to stave them off. Seeker's now going to come rolling through. A little bit of health back for 10x off that Devour. But uh, this is really important for Huns that he was able to stay alive here and get his alt up. This is buying a ton of time for them to get into positions, to wait around the corners. You can see Dubu's already nestled in by the snowman. See what 10x can do. 
Looks like he wants to clear around the back. Will manage to find one. He'll now coming in. Can get topped up. Just, just, just out of line of sight is this Viper. Gonna have to push in. I'm surprised they don't even just try to, you know, get a wall bang on the box. Oh, spots him and hunts that oh. close. Oh. Gets the shot. Beautifully done. Suggest now just racing, trying to get the spike planted for that extra money, but it's not gonna happen. Hun staying alive, being able to get his Viper pit up, wins that round, and oh here comes boy. Hyuni with the Operator. Yep, here we go, 10x dead. Hyuni just knows where to peek at the start of every single round. His awareness, it, it's just looking unparalleled. Hun's does get dropped, though. Terry now on the approach, but there's an Odin waiting for him in the kitchen. People gets rid of one, allow down to 29 HP with a couple knives left. 2v4. Try to defend this spike. Wall's gonna be broken. Skuna on the approach. Solo just hiding in the corner, but Bingsu, he's privy to this. He's not gonna get fooled. And they're just sticking this. He doesn't have the angle. He drops down. He's trying to spam through, but the Odin spams just a little bit better. Wow, well, gonna get up top again. So they're they're faking what they did the last time. They pushed through mid with that with that poison cloud. Uh, but this time it is a very different uh, maneuver here. They come under tube instead, and 10x gonna win that against Bingsu. Yeah, Bingsu dropping, making some noise. Does get spotted in the catch duo on that cross, just peeking backside of the site. 10x, great <laughs> shot. <laughs> Round of the corner fearlessly, gets that hit in live, but we'll be playing back in all likelihood. It's gonna just find one, but it's taken to a third of his HP. So it seems like the call for the save will be coming through. It's looking for the hit. Yoni will find 10x. And that's just, just you know, extra value. They do manage to find, despite the fact that this will be a round loss. Yeah, Perry's just seeing if he can get the timing right on the cross. Is just a step behind himself. And Yoni... Hyuni knows it. Hyuni knows something's coming and he's gonna look right down into Perry. I'm not even sure Perry got a... Maybe he got a... Empress pop now by 10x. Starting to get in the groove of things. Double Leers out, Allow goes on the push, the blind is going to be good. They find Skuna. Very nicely done. As we see Viper's Pit come up from Perry to just go ahead and lock this down and basically try to give DFR no hope of retaking this. Oh, Hyuni almost hit that. Jeez Louise, he is just so oh. smart. Dubu with a great shot with the Vandal, just starts spraying in there, catches a little bit of solo even. Just a little bit of damage, pops himself back up. Hyuni. Comes through, tries to get the Blade Storm out on the 10x, but doesn't manage to make it happen. Huns, let's find the rain up at the start of the run out of time. There's still three members left alive. Huns now going to fall. The Solo and Parry just being able to sit inside of the spike site, sit inside of this poison cloud. Yeah, it's just going to be too powerful for, up, for them. So Dubu with 10 HP will go ahead and retreat. This is New Turn's elected side, so we anticipate them to start things off fairly well. If he beats 10x there, that completely changes the dynamic of those crossfires. Oh, for sure. Dashing in. Oh, wow. He is just not going to be fast enough on the draw. He's going to get that kill, but 10x, yeah, knowing exactly where he's going to be, says he can't go anywhere else. He's just going to be stuck in the corner. They get the kill. They have the res. So Solo puts him back into the fight. A site lockdown yet again here for new turn. Who's finding one the Bulldog? There goes that toxic screen though to kind of cut him off a bit. Hyuni though, in between two toxic screens. Harry's lurk though. Oh. This could be absolutely huge, but he needs to strike. He goes in, finds one, gets a little bit of damage on the Huns. Oh, great readjustment. Turns their attention. Back over towards him. Pushing up, suggests finds Hyuni. Great tracking. Free course for it. A little bit of chip damage on a solo. Popped up and Hyuni's the first one to fall. Now Hun's gone. In turn looking to make this nine to three. Skuna goes for the lurk around the back. Will catch suggest off. See him being a, a bit disappointed in himself for getting caught there. Oh, Dubu. Dubu! Those Seekers. Trying to play this out as patiently as he can. They're so close to him right now. Perry just on the other side of the box. Bingsu will get 10x. A lot of the firepower now gone. But depending on which way Dubu decides to peek this, it could be huge or it could be tragic. He's moving forward. Tries to get the hit jump on the Perry. Cannot make it happen, but it does deal significant damage to him. Rez now puts Hunts back into the fight. Perry gets scooted up, but Allow is dead. And it's all just on Perry. Can he make it happen? A 1v1 with an HP disadvantage. Hunts 
by time. Rotating up top, and yeah, Perry just gonna try to play this one out as patiently as he can. Gets the 4K, and it's 9 to 3 on that. And we've seen him put it to great use, and there's the defender side toxic screen. Tenex gotta be careful, gets taken down by Huns. Huns finding that opening. Now, over towards screens, will get eliminated as Dubu has a very nice lurk, getting his way all the way back towards that defender's spawn area. Gets a kill, now looks to just help defend this spike plant with the rest of his team. DFR, very much love to get this pistol. Dubu put a dark cover down uh, right at the screen's door, and that force suggests up in the heaven, and a great setup here. Four! Quick. Dubu moving up into mid. Blind comes through. Nicely timed. They go on the peak. They manage to find a kill. Hyuni, however, does get the punish. Peek out suggest. Gets a hit. Now looking for the martial shots. Lines up Skuna's oh, head. Lines up Bingsu! Can't quite line up Hyuni as well. But so much damage is done. I was going to say allows all on his own, but that's all you need, Huns? Nope. So he gets a little help from Yanni. 10x there. Devour him. him. He's going to be leading the way, but right around the corner, Solo. Oh, he right gets, on his own. He gets a boost from Bingsu. <laughs> the wall. Just to really offset it even more, because we all know that tracking vertically is more difficult than horizontally. So Solo becomes that much harder to hit. Falls up for a third kill now in the round. And it's just Yoni by himself on the back end of Yellow. They get a couple shots and Solo will get the bar right now. So it seems like that, that adaptability in the series still coming through. Allow boosted up on top. He's managed to find Hyuni. One back and suggest will be eliminated. Dupu coming in across the zip line with Odin in hand of Allow. Guns he and Bingsu down before Huns can go ahead and Try to equalize, but now he is all on his lonesome in new turn. Looking to move up and lock in. At least that OT with a 12th round victory. <laughs> 10x, ah. 10x. Go ahead, gets that. Oh, you know, up there, vertically hiding himself uh, from the screen, and he sees the foot. It's just great peak timing here. He sees the foot of Yanni, backs off. Members of... Uh, DFR here. They're trying to corner check, but then Dubu just walks right into it. Just charging in. I mean, the paranoia not even going to be thrown in his general direction. Bit odd, and Dubu loses his life for it. Huns, a bit low, needs to get a heal from Bingsu here pretty soon. Seems like he has received it. Now, right now, just going to be sitting in the poison, eating that decay damage. Pulls back out, and we'll see if Newturn can pilot around the poison clouds to go ahead and close out Icebox. You blinds can lead the way. You do have, uh, you do have the counters vipers pit if you wanted to, I guess, as well. They're trying to bait him in by faking the spike plant. Tenex does fall. Suggests he gets two. Oh, he's Bingsu getting behind him. Well, it's gonna be eliminated now. Hans gets jumped on. That's gonna be the poison cloud dropping. Yunny in a one v one versus Parry. The youngin versus the veteran. The gun situation, pretty equal. Cloud Handle. gets dropped. Yeah. I mean, he can just sit here. He can wait for this timing. To hit onto A, which is, yeah, unoccupied at the moment. So this is going to be a free plant. There is Heaven uh, coming here from 10X. Dubu going to get right into hell there. Yanni watching. Oh. What a long range spray How with the frenzy. How does he do this with the frenzy? Oh, my God. That is ridiculous. We saw him get the clutch. We saw him get so many kills with the Frenzy on Bind. Now he gets that huge pick off across mid onto Parry. The next just looking to scout. Don't see too much of anything though, but Huns get eliminated. Dubu hooking out. Makes that a bit of a trade back. Solo now going to be dropping. Manages to catch one. Presses in. The right click is going to be good for another. Two bullets remaining. Has to go for the reload, and I believe he heard Hyuni above him. Wants to at least hold this to half, but you know, he's coming in for the push. Gets it halfway. Yeah, he push. can just play time, or he can just kill him. As well, and it's just one of those frustrating moments when you're playing Sky, and you're like, well, I can't heal myself. It's going to kind of jumping into that spray pattern. Does fall. Hun's taken down to 18 HP. The only person that could have healed him is now oh. dead. Allow. Drops off heaven. Finds a great headshot. Forces the tailwind from Hyuni. And I don't know if Yoni's going to be able to clutch this one. He's been coming up with some huge plays. But this is looking pretty done at the moment. Rotation through the spawn. 
Solo continues to lurk at eight just in case they try to shift that spike in, but 10x shuts down another, tries to line it up, can't make it happen. Suggests he's gonna be waiting in the back of the side. Gets the blind, lines him up. What after? Oh, push now coming in, allowed. Just oh, 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 oh. we what? are not watching the correct. Actually doesn't shift out of this spot, but. The blind is going to be good, and it's a bit of a greedy position there from Solo. Does get punished for it, but now time is ticking down. Hyuni, he's tailwind interesting. Doesn't move forward either way, and it's just a slaughter by 10x. Yeah, smart move not to go for that peak. Throws out the, uh, the dart. I mean, he takes him so very low. Great idea. And he's unhealable, but it does cost him his life. Fortunately, the gun is going to be unrecoverable. Solo, down to 40. Hyuni clears the corner. We'll get that kill. It's going to dead off screen, though. I mean, we are still in a 3v3, but as I say it, as the words crest the... Not yet. I said 2v2, and it's still 2v2. In mid, though, Dubu lose his head. Perry, spot. Anybody's going to create space. This guy can do it. He's going to see something weird going around that corner. Is it oh. able to get Perry? Dashes right in. Adam misses the right click. Oh, man. Not, oh, not quite sure how he whiffed that one, but got baited in by the low HP of Perry. Does fall solo now. Perfect timing, Picks, peeks out, finds two. Then X will clean up the last one. And Around the corner, the Owl Drone does not spot him. I was gonna say, he doesn't check the side. And Perry is still just sitting here, tries to spray through the smoke, doesn't quite get the kill initially, but then does manage to find it. And Solo just holds down the entrance, tries to swap to the classic. Cannot get it done, he cannot clutch it here for his squad, but it doesn't matter here. Oh, look at Suggest, look at how, look at how far into the back here he is. He's already been top. Seekers to start, Trailblazer to match. Spamming through the wall, trying to get that hit on the parry. Quite a bit of damage now coming in, allowed with the knives out, finds Dubu. Yanni, through the parry. It's only one member displaced and out of the sight. Skuna falling. Uh, to the back of, and Allow gets the opening pick on a Skuna. I mean, everything right now, going new turns way, and I mean, yeah, being too oh. screwed. He, I mean, he gets spotted. Now you can start spraying through, play yeah. pin the tail on the donkey. I like to think the 10X is sitting there just spraying through the wall, and he's just like, how do you like it? <laughs> After all of the trouble that they <laughs> that those Odins caused them on find. Huns with a really nice shot, does get the elimination on a solo. Gun's annoying, right? Ooh, Huns though, takes okay. down Perry as well, so Huns kind of feeling it this round. Getting himself over to A, there is Dubu. He's gonna teleport right over here as well. Over at Boiler, has to use the tailwind off screen. 10x drops down, looking for Dubu, gets that kill, and he just completely gated off right now. And Hunts is really the only one that has line of sight on this spike, and he needs to stop this defuse from coming in. Hyuni will get suggest, Hunts finishes off 10x, they're running out of time, but they're going to be sticking to it, but Hyuni pushes out, gets the kill on to allow, and DFR will like how good that is because of how fast they were able to do that, and then that Hunter's Fury at the end of lock it down. Suggest! suggest! Oh, oh my oh. god, he gets a third! Do we see a fourth right in the corner of Hyuni, but Suggest turns his back, and now Hyuni tries to turn this around. Oh. He gets three himself with a blade storm. Sees the Operator, can't quite line it up on the solo, but now he's made it possible. Po There's gonna be new turn to options. They don't have a ton of utility. And that's where one's at, plays around that line of sight from Allow. Solo just taking a couple shots and drops down. Huns finds the shot and he's got the club. Does get tagged up by that shock dart, so it's down to half HP. Well, I tell you what, I'm having a lot of fun in these last couple rounds. Solo, uh, this time Dubu's gonna wall bang him with that Odin. Now Dubu's back on that Odin. <laughs> They're just trading. Uh, through, the, through the walls. Let's see, all right, Spike is down. I think there's a lockdown here as well for yep. Bingsu. Solo's dead, so we can't use his. Hunter Fury just cleans it up, though, as, as anticipated. So it's just going to be that ult for ult trade. Perry finding Huns, working his way up around in the boiler now. Just find Bingsu through the floor, but Dubu just holding firm here with the Odin. He's going to try to back him up, Perry. Makes his way in onto the site. Skuna yet to get in here, but will fall. Parry cleans that up. Now new turn. Look, okay. <laughs> Are they? I think they did that on purpose. I think they're taking the door out early. All right. Well, either way, that is gone. But so is Hans. Drop from suggest. So they start making their way forward. Just kind of blinding Solo for a moment, but the lockdown will come in. And obviously Hans out of the fight, but didn't have the Hunter's Fury either. 10x. Nice wrap around. He knows that Bingsu likes to try to get in behind. 
gets that punish. Now catches Spina as well as he tries to exit out the main, but Keone parked up in heaven, finds two, but is that going to be enough? It's just Duba by himself, he might have the Odin, but they're trying to spray through and shut him down and should come through for allow. Everybody will start rotating out. Let's see how new turn try to play out the rest of this. Turret down on the site proper. There's a Trailblazer to lead the way here for DFR. We're going to have to take that turret down. Finally done. Allow's going to get Skuna from behind. Watching that long cross from Defender spawn here. Suggest. Going to try to deal uh, with the Sova up top. Oh. Huns gets Allow with the Shock Dart. Okay. All right. Well, nice. Pick up there from Huns. Suggest, however, just get the finish on it. Perry now pressing in. Sees the blind. Has to go for the reload. Get himself alive. So, Suggest going to grab the alt orb. Now all four members of New Turn kind of angling themselves here towards A. And they are going to indeed dash in. Flash oh, is the blind good. is absolutely massive from Suggest. Bows down two. Seekers now instantly invested. Stuck over at the door. Let me in! Let me in! <laughs> Jellyfish at the door. Nobody Not happening now. Yeah. 3v4 for the retake the DFR so desperately need to try to stay in this. One in heaven, one just below. Other on site. Dubu does manage to come out on top of one little exchange. Now it's just all going to be on 10x. He's so very low HP, but the time is ticking away. Dubu will find it in the end. 3k for have his trailblazer taken down. Uh, that's an alarm bot on to allow, so he's got to be careful. Door's going to be shut right away in response by DFR. They'll so break it out, break it down though, and spraying through this time with the Ares is Huns. Finds a kill, but allows straight in to the site. Now draft dr dash. Gets that kill with a right click. <laughs> Drafting again. I mean, he's got an idea of where Hyoni's going to be at. Uh, with just the Spectres in a 4v2, this is not looking great, especially when you approach this. You don't have your gun drawn out, but it's still going to be... It's going to beating 10x. That is definitely Whoops. not an exchange that 10x should lose. Trailblazer comes through. Allow. Oh, wow. I can tell he really wanted to push into main there, but decides to play it a little bit safer. Yeah, that was, that was a little bit tough there. Uh, Skuna just never felt confident enough to push out. Uh, that doesn't catch much there with that Guiding Light. Nano Swarm. Uh, gonna be used to buy a little bit more time, and there's a Lao again with the knives. One more to go. Right click misses. Yunny takes him down, but as the oh, Yunny takes another one here. He wants to dash in. I don't think he has enough time on the clock, but he can maybe get the finish. He gets the kill on DFR. Now need to win eight straight round in a very rough position. Now Just, they can't break this. Yeah, TP out has to be used. And he tries to snap back in to be a little bit cheeky, but Solo gets himself into boats fast enough. They find the kill. Now already a member down 4 HP on Bingsu has to get top back up as they slow down the play. Shot goes flying in, Solo get, get knocked down at 55 HP, but that's not good enough for the kill. Johnny now gone, that's the Bladestorm out of it, it seems like new turn. They very well just be able to close this right here. So he just keeps offering up blinds out from B main. Perry looking on the steps, and that's just going to be it, they mow them down.